A well-known proverb states, a satisfied customer is the best business strategy of all. And thus, Amazon has always placed a high value on customer satisfaction. In the modern e-commerce world, it's difficult to picture buying without reviews and ratings. So right from Amazon to Google and beyond, reviews and ratings are everywhere. Everyone, I'm Ankita Bajal, product evangelist at Sunrap, and today I'll be addressing a very interesting topic, Amazon reviews and ratings. Did you know that 91% of shoppers read online reviews and 84% of them trust online reviews and ratings? That's because they increase consumer trust and make the purchasing process more transparent, increasing consumer willingness to spend money. Now, what are reviews and ratings? Well, reviews and ratings let customers talk about their experiences with the product and give it an overall star rating. Customers rely on this information to make better informed purchasing decisions. Now, why are reviews and ratings important? Well, they provide authenticity and credibility to online purchase. They provide vital social proof to e-commerce purchasers who cannot see, touch or smell the product. Buyers can gain a general impression of the product's perspective through reviews and ratings. Buyers can also make a more informed purchase if they know whether an item is comfortable, true to size and of high quality. Reviews and ratings are essential not just during the purchasing process but also in driving sales, profits and important information. After understanding its importance, let's see how Amazon calculates product reviews and ratings. Since Amazon eliminated incentivized reviews and introduced verified and non-verified reviews, the process by which Amazon calculates a product's rating has gotten increasingly complex. When generating a product's average rating, Amazon employs a complicated weighted average algorithm. A product with only one 5-star review could have a rating ranging from 0 to 5. Amazon does not disclose the elements evaluated in this algorithm, although it is widely acknowledged that the following variables are significant, that is review age, review profile, number of reviews, average rating of reviews left, etc., length of review, rating versus return review, deviation from mean rating, number of helpful vote, and verified or non-verified. Essentially, a recent long review with a number of helpful votes returned by a reviewer with a powerful reviewer profile will likely to be near the top of your reviews and will also substantially weigh your total rating. Now let's move on to the important part, Amazon guidelines for reviews and ratings. Well, Amazon has numerous policies regarding reviews and ratings. Here are a few do's and don'ts to remember. Do's are sharing text, photos, videos and links. Marking a review as helpful. Don'ts are when commenting on pricing and product availability. Avoid comparing the costs of the same item at other retailers and refrain from discussing the product's availability at a particular store. Content written in languages that are not supported. Creating, editing or posting content about your own products or services is not permitted. Repetitive text spam, and images made with symbols. Do not submit content that infringes on the privacy of others or divulge personal information such as your phone number, email address, order number, and so on. When it comes to Amazon reviews, the more, the better. For example, a product rated 4.5 stars by 15 people will not sell as well as a product rated 4 stars by 500 people. More reviews authenticate your product, increase trust and confidence among other customers and increase the visibility of your products too. Let's look at some strategies to get more reviews on Amazon. First, provide an excellent customer experience. Most unfavorable reviews mention how customers were misled about a product. To avoid any misunderstandings or false expectations, be truthful about what you are offering and provide correct information about your products. Second, after an Amazon purchase, send uh, customers customized requests for reviews. This will enable them to provide the product with honest feedback. Third, the amount of customer opinions can expand thanks to social media. For instance, 
you can occasionally launch campaigns on Twitter, Instagram and Facebook asking followers and supporters to share their opinions and experiences. Fourth, the top reviewers on Amazon are recognized for their insightful and unbiased assessments. Since their opinions are extremely significant, you can ask them to write product reviews for you. Fifth, introduce new products to an email list. Hopefully, you have been expanding your email list outside of Amazon. If you have an email list, don't send links to your website shopping page when you announce new products. Instead, send them directly to your Amazon product description page on Amazon. Sixth, use the request a review button. This button increases the rate of reviews by around 10 to 20 percent. The most crucial thing is that the number of reviews is to increase the probability that existing customers will leave one. Seventh, product giveaways and discounted products. You can enhance sales of your products and the chance of more reviews by offering substantial discounts. Eighth is, use Amazon to contact critical reviewers. Until recently, it was practically difficult to know a bad reviewer's identity. In 2021, however, Amazon rolled out the option to contact customers who have submitted reviews with fewer than three stars. Ninth is great packaging. In e-commerce, appealing product packaging encourages customers to overlook problems while unappealing packaging forces them to notice the flaws. The first impression a consumer has of your goods is its packaging, and this is frequently the basis for their review. Use full color boxes. Even for the most basic products, include sufficient user manuals and other product inserts to give your product a professional appearance. Tenth this, utilize the Amazon review services. Amazon merchants struggle with generating early reviews for new products. Customers are less likely to buy new products that have no reviews. The product review platforms Amazon Vine and Amazon Early Reviewer Program were created and managed by Amazon. Amazon's Early Reviewer Program is an effort to assist sellers in gathering reviews for new products. In this program, Amazon contacts randomly selected buyers of the participating products and asks them to provide a review. The Amazon Wine program is a relatively quick and easy way to add product reviews to a listing. Amazon Wine allows the most reputable reviewers to share their product reviews. This is done so that other customers can make informed choices about what to buy by giving them frank and objective comments on the item. Based on their ranking as reviewers, Amazon invites particular customers to become Wine Voices. These reviewers receive free products from participating sellers and brands thanks to Amazon. Few requirements to enroll in Amazon Wine program are Be a professional seller Enroll in the Amazon brand registry Have fewer than 30 reviews or ratings on the Amazon product you wish to enroll under Amazon Wine program The item should be available under Amazon FBA in the new condition Maintain sufficient inventory Products are uh, introduced during the registration process. On the listing page, the enrolled product must have an image, a title, and a description. No adult products, apps, or digital software are allowed. Additionally, keep in mind that certain products are not permitted to participate in the Amazon Wine program. So these consists of items sold in packages, heavy or bulk items, sample goods, hazmat goods, dropship items. These strategies will help you to bring in great Amazon reviews. Now let's address the elephant in the room. How to deal with negative reviews. Positive and negative customer reviews are an integral component of the Amazon seller experience. Responding quickly to a negative review is the first step in handling one. Make sure to begin with an apology and express gratitude to the reviewer for their honest views. Responding to negative reviews provide you to opportunity to better understand the situation and include new details that can be useful to prospective customers. The negative review might remain, but the readers will have new information to consider before making a purchase. Now let's move on to the best part, benefits of Amazon reviews and ratings. First, reviews provide crucial market information and help develop better products. It takes a lot of research to sell on Amazon, the Amazon Review Analysis Tool can help you in analyzing reviews of new products. If you are an Amazon seller trying to expand your product lineup, before releasing the product, you may determine precisely what clients desire and what their problems are. 
consumer opinions on the goods are reflected in their reviews and ratings on Amazon. You can genuinely better grasp consumer needs and interests by analyzing product reviews. Additionally, it would give you marketing intelligence about the kinds of goods that customers are more likely to buy. You'll better grasp your own product and why it might or not operate with the help of this insightful information. Second, Amazon product reviews boost sales and rankings. If you are a seller in the technology sector of the industry, Amazon reviews and ratings are quite significant. The majority of purchases made in the technology category are determined by the reviews and ratings of the specific product. Therefore, it makes sense that the majority of consumers will check for reviews and ratings when looking for high-tech products. Amazon product reviews and ratings always affect where a product appears in search results as savvy sellers are aware of. Therefore, your product's ranking, discoverability and sales will also improve as more people give it more positive reviews. Third, Amazon seller feedback facilitates Amazon buy box wins. Every seller dreams of getting the buy box. The buy box winning is influenced by the seller feedback on Amazon, which is a component of the customer's total Amazon purchasing experience. Maintaining customer satisfaction as your first priority will help you to get positive feedback from customers and a good seller rating. The rating and the ROI of the product are directly impacted by the product's positivity or negativity. Fourth, ratings and reviews boost conversion rates. Similar to this, Amazon reviews serve as catalysts for increased purchases. As a result, consumers rely heavily on product reviews. This indicates that one of the determining reasons for conversion rates on Amazon is customer reviews. Reviews and ratings engage customers. Constant social activity and customer feedback can transform the reviews and ratings page into a helpful forum or community. You can instantly establish a solid reputation with your clients by actively participating in such a community. These benefits entail how significant reviews and ratings are for improving brand awareness and accelerating conversions. The bottom line is that the customer is the king. They have the power to either significantly lower or raise the bar of your company. Their opinions are really valuable because only their experiences will determine how good your product is. More customer reviews and ratings on your products can persuade more customers to make a purchase from you. And that's it for this video everyone. Thanks for watching. Your support means a lot to us. It encourages us to bring out more helpful videos like this. If you found this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe to SellerUp. Let us know if you guys want us to create an in-depth seller guide on any specific topic. You can leave your suggestions in the comment section below and we'll create them for you. If you haven't already, click the bell icon so that you will never miss on any other video. And as always, happy selling!